All right, guys. So next thing we do, here's the, here's one of the feet that I did for the um, Wendigo uh, piece. See, I I got done three printing it, and the next thing I want to do is kind of get rid of all this, all these print lines to it. Yeah. I could automatically just paint them and be done with it, but no. I kind of want to fill them in. But they did print pretty nicely. Yeah. And this is, this is a good size, uh, this is a good size foot. I went in there and I took, um, I went in there, and I had to do some more adjusting on this character. Um, I took a... I took the um, leg bone up there to where the, the lower legs are connected to the, um, the foot on the original animatronic. And... It gives that fill of this, and we got more of a look on here. The bone is big enough to go on there and connect to the femurs. That I just got done kind of, just I got done sculpting and making the video last night. Well, making the sculpting video last night. So the next idea right now is to fill this character, fill these feet up. I'm going to be looking at basically filling the feet and then making the bone, making the femur, the leg bones, the lower legs, the, the tibula and the fibula, making them one piece. Because here's the original, here's the whole entire thing. It's a big bone. And it, it needs to be reconnected together and filled in. I temporarily have a little piece of cardstock gluing the pieces together. With some super glue, but I want to make this bone one piece. So I'm going to be doing some filling in for this bone. Um, probably, probably some Bondo work, maybe some JB Weld work. JB Weld work has has a has a clear epoxy that I can use on there that I can use on there I'll just do some different things on here and this would connect up to here Giving it a, giving a look up here. So pretty much this bone's like 700, over 700 millimeters tall. But, yeah, that's the closest work I got to do today. My, I'll be posting the, um, I'll be posting the fibulas. I'll be posting the Fibula video pretty soon. As soon as I as soon as I can, I will go get the um I will do another video and I'll get to work on these leg bones. The other leg the other foot
cracked on me when I was taking it off the bed. Because I used a 5% a five infill and it was just way too light and it just cracked and broke off. So I'll get ready to just start working on this. Probably in a couple more weeks I'll have an... I'll wait till I can connect the next uh, part. This is just waiting around for new, uh, just waiting around for a few things. Till I can go get some, some JB Weld epoxy until I can get me in there roll filament. That will get me a new, that will get me another part. So yeah, this is just an updation video that I did for this character. You can just see how much work I still want to do. These print lines are just not what I want. That's the one thing about print lines. They show up and everything. This leg will be more connected together. I and this is what was digitally sculpted that you saw in the video. Just a little bit more cleanup on these these feet. So I'll see you guys later.